you're filming me on Skype, not to be used. But you know what? No, uh, I, I actually take that back. I got to think about that. I don't want to really be. Uh, I have a web presence. I gotta get. I gotta get a. I, I got. I, I, ah. You know what? It's it's 105:37. I'm gonna leave this on, but that's the exact time my psychotherapist tells me to uh, to leave the building. Okay, let me know. I, I, need to, I need to throw up. I'm talking to you. Let me tell you a story. How I became an entertainer. Back in 1961, my, pa my parents always brought me to a radio city music club. We had Cad State for $1.49 with the garlic bread. And uh, then we went to Radio City and Music Hall. And I used to s sit in the first row, watch the Rockettes, the orchestra. I love that. And then go back to the mez mezzanine where we got tickets uh, to see a movie. But on NBC, this is when TV just came out. They, they, they used to be this, like, plank, this, this walkway where you used to walk. Uh, and on the street level, on 50th Street, people saw you being taped on the TV. You got this, so I'm walking, people walk down this plank, and then people on the outside would look because it was TV, it was a new thing. I, the guy who sneaked into Bob Mitzvahs and weddings, and if they kept me at the smallest part of the dinner, but I was dancing before I danced, I did this whole thing uh, in, in front of this, of the uh, TV camera, and on 50th Street, there was a crowd of people that came and watched. That was 1961. Those were the days.